China and Russia are significantly exploring stablecoin adoption as they expand their digital currency exposure and seek a more independent financial system amid Western sanctions. The EU is the rise of stablecoins about to reshape the global financial landscape, challenging US dominance in the cryptocurrency space? Stay tuned until the end of this video, where we'll reveal a groundbreaking strategy that could tip the scales in favor of you. Subscribe to our newsletter in the description to be the first to discover under the radar altcoin gems. Click on the link in the description to join now. We publish daily updates on promising under the radar altcoin gems, s. Policymakers and reshape the future of stablecoins forever. s. Treasury is increasingly concerned as Russia, the most sanctioned country globally, leverages stablecoins to navigate these hurdles. Reports suggest that the Chifa platform, facilitating trade between China and Russia, is experiencing a surge in stablecoin payments highlighting their benefits and presenting new challenges for U.S. policymakers. Deputy Chairman of the Bank of Russia, Alexei Guznov, emphasizes initiatives to utilize stablecoins for international money transfers, underscoring their potential to promote a self-reliant economy within the decentralized finance space. U.S. Undersecretary of the Treasury Wally Adeyemo warns that existing sanctions seem ineffective against stablecoins, especially as the market navigates their volatility. The rise of stablecoins like Tether, USDT, being used for military financing raises significant concerns regarding U.S. financial security and the potential for terrorist groups to exploit stablecoins for illegal activities. ADEMO proposed secondary sanctions on foreign crypto businesses supporting sanctioned entities, emphasizing robust Know Your Customer, KYC, and anti-money laundering, AML, measures to protect the integrity of the stablecoin market. Former President Donald Trump urged the U.S. to engage with cryptocurrencies warning against China's potential dominance in the stablecoin sector. Senator Cynthia Lummis argues against excessive taxation on Bitcoin mining, claiming it could hinder innovation and cryptocurrency investments, ultimately affecting overall crypto growth and limiting effective investment strategies. Economist Daniel Lacalle reminds us of the beauty of cryptocurrencies in their decentralization but warns that increased government control threatens stablecoin market stability. As China and Russia pivot deeper into stablecoin usage, U.S. policies must adapt to this evolving landscape and ensure a strong comparison between stablecoins and traditional fiat currency. Join our newsletter in the description to uncover altcoins before they explode. Get early access to under-the-radar altcoin gems ready to skyrocket before everyone else. Join in the link in the description. Investment strategies leveraging the benefits of stablecoins, while ensuring financial security, are essential in today's trading environment. What do you think about these developments surrounding stablecoins? Can the US effectively counter these advancements? Share your insights below, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on the dynamic cryptocurrency market and the future of stablecoin innovations.